So I want to know what happened in the beginning of the universe. This makes me get out of bed in the morning and say, this is important, important stuff. When we look at the beginning of the universe, we're looking at light that's coming to us from 13.8 billion years ago. The further we look out in distance, the further we're looking back in time. The rings on Saturn really look awesome tonight. We can't help it, that's the way the speed of light works. In the old days, before you plugged the cable into your cable TV and actually had an aerial, about 1% of the noise that you would get called snow between channels is from the cosmic microwave background. We've designed this telescope class to measure a, a wide range of properties of this special light that we have, and it carries with it an imprint of the physics that happened at the very beginning of the universe. Because we want to see most of the sky, we have chosen a spot in the Atacama Desert in northern Chile for situating the class telescope. Class is uniquely designed to measure large swaths of the sky without going to space. But we had to build special technology in to do this. Class is also designed to separate out the, uh, the radiation from our own Milky Way galaxy from the signal from the very early universe. That's difficult to do, and CLASS has been designed to do that. We have Johns Hopkins students involved in every aspect of this telescope, from working on the, the mount structure and how to move it around to scan the sky, to, ramp up the current. to the modulator that makes it possible for us to do this experiment. From the optics, which are custom made, to the cryogenics, the cooling of the detectors. 273 degrees below zero. To the detectors themselves that focuses the radiation from the sky. These filters I've been working on have performed quite well, and they stand a good chance of actually being used inside the telescope. Have a bowl there. For me as an undergrad, just getting the chance to do really original research, that is the coolest thing. What we're trying to, to observe is, is billions of light years away. Our lab is really the entire universe. The potential of the CLASS telescope is extraordinary because it is the ideal machine for answering the questions that we have to answer, which is, how did the universe begin? We don't need to know that for our everyday survival. We want to know it because we're human.